we are grinding today and this is my third time under the grinder i don't know how much grinding they actually have left to do because my cameras were dead this morning and they're charged now but okay so i heard on the radio that there is one truck in here and the grinder is back here so The chaos of this job is that this is an apartment complex and there's nothing closed. It is 100% open. So the people that live here are in and out and there's cars and pickup trucks and things all over the place. I'm trying to figure out what the heck's going on. Let's see if I can scoot up here and see. Okay, there's the grinder. Way over in the distance. I just noticed they have an excavator there with a, with uh, a track off. Right here. The grinder is up there in front of me and there's a truck under it and they had the track fall off this excavator right here, so it looks like they're trying to fix it. Well, this is fun. As you all know, I ship the majority of my merch myself. This created a problem for my workspace. I needed a desk that worked well when I needed to be able to move around while packing and shipping orders, as well as when I was sitting down editing, billing, or on a dreaded Zoom call. That is when I found FlexiSpot. I love how my E7 Plus is so stable that it does not have a problem lifting me and all of the equipment I keep on my desk. FlexiSpot amazing brand day sale. Don't miss out. FlexiSpot provides all kinds of standing desks to meet your demands. If you prefer a rock solid stability standing desk, then the E7 Plus is your top choice. If you want a premium standing desk for daily use, you can check out their E7 and E7 Pro C frame. If you're on a limited budget, you can choose their E5 model. Unlock more savings by using the exclusive promo code provided in the description. Click the FlexiSpot link to enjoy these fantastic discounts. tiny bit of material in and then have me turn around and wait. They typically honk when they want you to go forward and when they want you to stop. He honks twice to get you to go forward and then he honks once to get you to stop. So that's why I have the windows down so I make sure that I hear him.
concerning for me to have cars going the opposite way with him loading me like this, but I guess I am not here to think. I'm just here to drive the truck. They swing their boom back and forth like that while inside of a truck. Blows my mind. Yeah, I've been watching him because uh, every time he gets close to my truck, I'm like, ooh, do I need to pull away? <laughs> See, letting out the clutch there was not smooth at all. There's like not a gear yeah. low enough. Trying to get that other truck's attention, I guess. I don't know. Oh no, the hand signals. Oh, there's a white mark in the middle here, I guess. I guess we're gonna keep going. Okay, after a quick powwow, now we are gonna get resituated and go again. wanted to steal your phone and take a picture of you. <laughs> it's like a badass in there. <laughs> That's funny. They, somebody got a really good picture of me under... Oh. I'm sorry, I'm deaf. One of the guys got a really good picture of me grinding on another job uh, like a few weeks ago. It was really good. You look like a badass. Though. <laughs> I love it. I just met you and I love it. Oh, thank you. <laughs> As it'll take to get up there and dump out. Yeah. You like those street tires? Yeah. Did you ever get stuck? Mm -mm. Very rarely. No, I go, I go all kinds of off-road places. I just don't get stuck often. better traction than you think. Well, I'm hoping that I'm doing the right thing. No one's telling me what to do, so, you know. Oh, he's setting it down, so I guess I'm probably doing the right thing. It's probably just gonna take off this strip right here where all the potholes are. See the other side of him. Oh, there we go. Got a little too far. I'm trying to make it easy on myself and just roll in low, low, but it's way too fast. I can hear it hitting the front of the box. The 
this grinder is also super narrow, so you can't, like, if he gets right behind me, I can't see him at all. <laughs> a little more so you can get up over them and then it like sucks you away. full in the front but there's nothing in the back so let's take a look there's a lot of waiting <sighs> looking for work for next week so far, nothing. Hopefully, I find something. Put a few calls out a couple hours ago and then sent a couple text messages to the guys that do dispatch to see if they had anything extra. go forward. That's usually the stop. Uh, that's crazy. Oh. <laughs> uh, I don't know where he's trying to go. I guess there's some spots right here. Getting it in the back of the freaking truck. Like, way in the back, it's what I mean. Jesus. Cars everywhere. Oh my god. Oh my gosh. What is this car doing?
load. Loaded. I don't think that. Okay, I have to tip it. Can you help me level it off? Okay. Okay. So. Uh, uh, right here. the box up a little bit and level it off because there's tons of material like in the first two thirds like closest to the cab and like nothing in the back and then it's over like it's the materials too high up in the box to be legal Check it, make sure that, oh great. Car should be able to get out. This one could be right there. There. Okay. I'm gonna check it. Check, clean the back and the sides. Ah, way better. That's way better. Okay. Uh, I'm gonna move. I guess I get like a yard or two in the back of my truck. talking to me. I'm like noted, but he doesn't know that I hear him because I'm not saying anything. seemed like you were worried we wouldn't get it done and it looks like it's pretty close. I was concerned we would be stuck in traffic at 530 trying to get the last set of loads out. Yeah. yeah. So give you a oh right, Ready right. Go. And are you owner operator? I am. Okay. Do you got my contact info? Um I don't. 
Why don't we get that on there? Okay. Can you email it over? Yeah. Okay, cool. Awesome. Have a good weekend. Thank you, Ryan. Good. Make sure the PTO's off, box is down. Let's go driving some. What's that? It's talking. Is... What was that? So have a blessed night and enjoy your weekend. Oh, yeah, you too. Thank you. site but whatever I I built for it so it is what it is right okay well it's probably gonna be an hour up there maybe more hour and a half it's probably time to turn the cameras off and just cruise made it into the asphalt plant here in Everett. They are already closed, but that doesn't matter because I'm just going to dump in the recycle pile and there's no ticket or scaling. It's fine. This is the biggest I've ever seen, the recycle pile. Get this load off, make sure that the tailgate's clear and I get to go home. I'm excited. Today was a good day. It was fun basically running away from the grinder all day. leave the box up while I clean the gate because it brings the gate closer to me and I'm short. material in here and I don't think I have a video of me doing it but they have a drive over so the majority of the material is barged in and then loaded by those belts back there and put into the piles but I have brought material in for them and 
driven over the drive over and like dumped it in the drive over and then watched it go up and come out like way down the line. It was, it's cool. It's fun. I like stuff like that. All right, guys, if you have made it this far in the video and you are not subscribed, please subscribe now. It really helps out the channel and I really appreciate it. If you're interested in Beyond Dirt merch, the link is in the description and I will see you guys next time.